the last time this group appeared at Coachella was 2016. If anything, the hip hop supergroup made up of Killer Mike and LP have become even more politically charged due to the events of the recent years. Despite lyrics that reflect serious messages and tones, they ultimately want to have fun and spread positivity and perform electrifying shows of the music they love. I want to welcome my brothers, Run the Jewels, man. What's up, G's? What's up, man? How, How y'all feeling? You. Yeah, good. good. Yo, man, it's been a minute, man. Welcome back. Thank you. It's been about, uh, I want to say, what, like like, like six, five, six years? Yep, yep. Has it? Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Crazy, right? Yeah. I was yeah. actually here when y'all played, you know, so it's, it's a good it's a good time. It's been a it's been a very crucial past couple of years, a lot of recentering, you know what I mean? A lot of reflecting, um, very important times. Y'all put out an album, you know, RTJ4, during a, during a moment in, in life, you know what I mean? And so um, I know at, during that time, you guys were looking forward to being able to, to tour that. That energy was in alignment with what was going on in the world, and you guys didn't get to do that. But now we're here. How, how y'all feeling, man? Excited, glad that it's finally that we get to rock again. Yep. You know, I mean, that's what we love to do. Yep. That's how we got our rep. You know, we, we like to do shows and we like to make music. And we got to do the music and we were ready to do the shows in 2020. And right. So I'm excited. Yep. I'm just here so I don't get fined. No, I'm just <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm super crunk, man. Like, you know, I, I was excited um, to, to get booked a couple years ago. I was disappointed when I found out. You know, because of the world pandemic that, you know, it wasn't going down. And when they told us the world's opening back up, man, I was super geeked up. So I'm very happy to be here today. Nah, it's a moment, man. You got man. an email. They were like, the world's open now. <laughs> yeah. Well, Atlanta never closed, technically. No, Atlanta never closed. <laughs> You're right about that. Yeah, shouts no, out to the blue flame nah, but and But the good governor. thing is that y'all kept it moving on the Internet and kept the presence strong. So now the people get to feel that. And um, I, I think this is time, and, you know, even with Rage Against the Machine, the fact that y'all got invited back, too, because – on some real, you know what I mean? Like, you got to keep keep the music, keep the energy intact. So if you got invited back and now in this present time to play on one of the biggest stages, clearly you're doing something right. So yeah. I'm excited for that, man. What what can we expect today on, on, with the energy? Man, a brutal 45 minutes is what we want to <laughs> give you, you know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, same shit we always do. Yeah. It's just an explosive, Just fun, going in. fun show. Yeah, because, and... you know, like, recording music, you know, hit playing in the car at the crib playing in the headphones, but playing live, it's just a certain type of energy. And, For sure. You know and I mean? we don't have too many bells and whistles. I think that we, we model ourselves after, like, Run DMC. Like, yeah. two MCs, a DJ, and we'll do a stadium. Classic we can, you know, style. Like, Absolutely. Yeah. 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 So, and so. it's far because I want to talk about, um, man, I wish Rage was here, but the fact that y'all, like, Rage does not just bring anybody. It's a classic, one of the first to play Coachella. Yeah. And for, for you guys to still, to still, like, run with them on this upcoming tour, man. You know what I mean? How, how does that feel with a classic band? For like me, that? I mean, the only other rap group that I've known that opened for them was Wu-Tang. So, you know, when you look at that, at the mark that's been set, it's real. So, I mean, Run the Jewels, man, we here to kick ass. Like, yeah. That's what, you know, no matter who you put us in front of, but putting us in front of one of our favorite bands yeah. and favorite people, you know yeah. what I mean? Meaning, like, we have a relationship with Zach, relationship with Tom. Like, when you do that. Yo, it's, it's classy. Yeah, that's it's going right to be there. some. Yes, pyro. Even know. if we ain't setting off no fire, we <laughs> yeah. we lighting that we lighting that stage on fire for sure. And 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 it's a very cool cosign because anyone who knows Rage Against the Machine knows that their their fans are getting a level of show that is heads and shoulders above most Word. most shows. Yeah. And if they think that we can hold it down, then then you know then Absolutely. it's, then Which it's a huge could. And it's crazy because you both have your individual history with Coachella. I remember uh was it 2015 with Outcast. You came out the first weekend and I think you got cut off like well, it, the Outcast overtime. set got cut. Yeah, yeah they, they got went cut, over so you couldn't even and then yeah. you came I was and driving killed. trying to came make back, the set. Yeah, you you killed it week, week two, right? Murdered. Yo, as artists, what does that feel like? What's the difference from weekend one and weekend two in terms of energy? How, weekend one you wanted to cry yeah. <laughs> yeah but 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 i i'm, I'm looking forward to this week because we haven't been on stage together in a um, minute since last fall since yeah. last fall winter yeah so it's just like to me man spring training is over we back it's we the back season. in it it's game yeah. time but Hawks the, in the playoffs and we're on stage but Boy. the secret truth to coachella that no one ever admits is that weekend two is really is the, the one. That's the one. I, I mean, it's always fun to come out. Weekend one is exciting. Everyone's excited. Mm -hmm. It's it's everyone. The energy's there. But weekend two, everyone's 
in their zone. Exactly. And, and uh, honestly, you, well, you. Why do you feel though, like, because you made the adjustments during week one? You, you saw what worked. Yeah, what but didn't. also because you're like, okay, I'm not nervous. You know, it's I'm like not nervous Coachella's no a big deal. You want to come out and you want to smash it and shit, and everyone's right. here for the right reasons. But weekend two is often. It, just a little it's bit better. It's always admiring and humbling too. Like when I hear even people of your y'all level that been doing this, we all get we still all get nervous. We all still have that anxiousness. Yeah, totally. And you still lay it all down on the line. But That's you would why never we drink. Tell. Right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> true. True. And, and the crazy thing is, you also have a lot of history too. You've been here different times with different groups. Like this. Yeah, I'm actually on the low. I think it's a verifiable fact that I think I'm the I'm. I, as a living artist, I've been here more times than any other living artist. Wow. We need to check how with Soldier Boy, though. I don't <laughs> remember how many times. I think it was about, uh, well, in terms of just like, I was here, th you know, they do the double weekend, so I'm not counting that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying a total Overall of, appearances. this is probably our, this is my probably seventh appearance wow. at Coachella. So you're a, you're, a, you're a Coachella veteran legend. Yeah, I was here when game. it was like small. You That's crazy. I mean? so, you pre internet, so, pre all that. All that. So, you I know, love but that, horse man. and buggies, um, they didn't have fire back then. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It, it was, was just crazy. straight raw, like my crowd, connect with the people, and and uh, yeah, man, I think it's dope. So I, I'm just happy that you guys are here. I think the moment is yours. You guys are here for a reason. Know that. I know the world is excited. There's people in the crowd when, when y'all were playing in different times or we're trying to be here. There's people that are inspired by y'all. So I just want to show love. Thank you. All Thank right? You. Yo, Thank have you. a good set today, man. All right? Absolutely. Love Yo, and respect. Much love. Appreciate you, man. All right? Thank you. Yep. Let me give you some, some dabs over here. Make sure, be sure to check out Run the Jewels performance from the Coachella main stage on Channel One. There's plenty more of your favorite artists and live performances still to come right here at Coachella 2022. Keep it locked.